Yo, what up, hype man? It's your boy Sports Ten Ninety back on the channel. Get a day for you guys with a new game. Dragon Quest Monsters: The Dark Prince just came out today, and we rocking with it tonight. I love the Dragon Quest Monster series. I love Dragon Quest in general, but the Monster series is my favorite series out of the Dragon Quest series. So, without further ado and prolonging the intro, we gonna get into it. Dragon Quest Monsters: The Dark Prince. Let's ride. You successfully claim the following. Head start set. All right. Don't know what that is. Didn't even know about it until I got it. So let's wait. Let's see options real quick. Uh, camera controls. Vertical. Inverted. Y'all know how I roll. I'm going fast on the camera. Uh, rather than not, the camera moves behind your character when you start moving. Uh, let's see. We'll check that out later. Up all the way. Sound like I am. Okay. Just checking. All right. So now, text settings, English, voice auto play. Choose whether or not dialogue text moves automatically during voice scenes. On dialogue speed. There we go. Okay. Display. We're good. All right, let's get this thing rolling. You know, I got to go with my boy. Hey, Sorrow. Wasn't he on Dragon Quest Heroes? Pretty sure. We're good there. Oh, we could have done all this stuff over here. Okay, whatever. Whatever. Ordinary human, Gorin, help me get him inside. So, if he's no ordinary human, what's he supposed to be? He is none other than Randolfo the Tyrant's son. A prince amongst us monster folk. Randolfo's son? But he looks like any other human. They say Randolfo had a child with a human woman, but the boy's whereabouts were unknown. But what would he be doing here in Nadiria now? Well... Hey, 
you are, darling. Have those bullies been picking on you again? But you're tougher than anyone, Your Highness. Why not show them who's boss next time? No, Glupert. Listen carefully. No matter what happens, you are not to lay a finger on a human. You are not like them. And that means you have to try twice as hard as anyone else to be human, if not harder. what moved into that little art in the woods, ain't ya? You sneaky rotter. Hey, stop that! Oh, what do you want, Evan? I suppose you think you're some kind of hero wanting to protect this idiot. Ow, that hurts. Are you all right there? <laughs> I guess neither of us is much of a hero. doing it a piddling backwater like this. <sighs> Is that you? How come you're so strong? And what did it mean monster kind royalty? Listen to me. You have to remember, each of us is burdened with our own destiny. My darling boy, please embrace your humanity. Your father rules over Nadiria, but that is not your concern. Just please, whatever you do, stay. Away from him, I beg you. L Lady Miriam! Huh? Oh, 
Thankfully, she's just snoozing. Where are you going, Your Highness? Nadiria? Don't goo, Your Highness. Come back! Ah, I see you're awake. I know you've come a long way, but you'd best give up on your plan to see your father. Hmm? Oh, not interested in my warning, I see. He's come all this way alone. Impressive. Though I wouldn't expect any less from one of your sons, Rantolfo, my lord. Help me, boy of mine. Why do you return to the underworld, from which you are an outcast? <laughs> you intend to take arms against me? Very well. Allow me to show you exactly where you stand. You are now cursed, unable to harm creatures of monster blood. That should deter you from returning here. Now prepare to be sent to the end of time itself! Globo Oscuro! So you are here, progeny of human and monster. I am the one who sees all. I am sorry to tell you that your mother passed a short while ago. Henceforth, you will do as she wished and live your life as a human. I shall remove the monster blood that courses through your veins for you. Why do you resist? Hmm. I see. So you would have your revenge by deposing him and taking his title as master of monster kind. For this, you will require the strength of a monster, no doubt. Very well. You are the master of your own destiny.
Wakey, wakey, lad. It's only me, Royston. You were moaning and groaning a fair bit. Bad dreams, I take it. Oh, Monty asked about you, by the way. Let's go see him when he get the chance. All right, so I always know that Dragon Quest always has about 15 to 20 minutes worth of um, go up here, of dialogue and story before we play. So that's why I let y'all just enjoy the story I took myself off. But now we in here. So you can move your character with the left stick and control the camera with the right stick. You can interact with certain objects and speak to people approaching them and pass and pressing A. Press B to jump. Oh, you can jump. Hey. Ooh, camera does move fast. I might need to slow that down just a little bit. But uh, let's talk to. By the way, will you be busy looking for a way to ungoo your curse again today, Your Highness? I'm not complaining, but I just wish you had more slime to hang out with. To hang out with me. Okay, so if I go out here, let's go down here. I just want to check all my all my nooks and crannies. I acquired a medicinal herb. Okay. You always got to check everything in these games. All right, so let's go outside. If you ever get stuck and aren't sure where to go next, see if you can spot a pink speech bubble. The person you find might be able to help point you in the right direction. The location of your current objective is marked uh, on the map with a red icon. In the top right of the screen, you'll find the handy mini map, but you can press Y to open the main map and get a detailed picture of the lay of the land. Okay. See, I'm not, okay, so I'm not gonna go through and talk to everybody because that'll take too freaking long. So I just go and talk to like these people. Oh. Hey, yep. Uh, uh, don't forget to pay Monty a visit, will you? He'll be mooching. He'll be mooching about the counter at his shop just across the way. Okay, so yeah, those people right there, those tell those people tell you where you need to go. This is the inn that you can go to to uh to take a nap, whatever. Get your uh get your HP up. Uh, completely heal yourself. Uh. You always check this stuff. See, five gold coins right there. Okay, so now I pick up the barrel. No, I cannot. Okay, so let's go around here. There's a pot up here. Okay, okay. yeah, I gotta slow that camera down. Good lord. It's okay, so no. Okay. All right, let's go talk to. Yep, right here. That reminds me. Oh, there you are, lad. Well, I'm sure you know why I'm so eager to see you. That's right. I want to talk about the curse of yours, the one that stops you from harming monsters. I know you've been burning the midnight oil, researching ways to get rid of yourself of it. And we've got you to thank for the magic barrier protecting Rose Hill from human folk and wild monsters. Everyone in the village is grateful to you, lad. To think you just wandered wandered in lost one day, and now you're like family. But truth be told, we're no closer to finding a cure for your curse than the day you came. Which is why I think it's time for you to try a new approach. And that approach is, um, hold on a minute. Where did I put my blessed notes? What's all this? Oh, Blumenek. 
Don't tell me. <laughs> so this is the village he's hiding in. So your blighters are back again, are ya? Well, I'm not stunned for it. Mm. <laughs> this one's no pushover. <laughs> you really think you stand a chance against us? Jeez. You know he gotta be dead. He didn't hit him with a scythe and an axe. Hmm, hit him with a fireball? Bro, you just got hit with a fireball. You should be gone. What's the matter, boy? Struck dumb with fear, are you? You can't! You can't do harm to a monster! It's your lucky day. A certain important someone wants a word with you. Is that that dragon I was talking to? No. Right, my darlings. Kindly let these monkey monsters know they've outstayed their welcome. So he's gonna show me how to capture monsters. Or befriend them. Curse you! We'll be back. And next time, you'll be coming with us. You're not hurt, are you, lad? Good. Good. I'm just glad I made it in time. I knew we'd be having unwelcome guests again. But I just didn't expect them quite so soon. Hmm? You're keen to know who these monsters are? Well, I'll tell you all about it later. First things first, we need to tend to the injured. And I've got just the monster for the job. This way. It's one thing I don't like about the where were we? It's one thing I don't like about the Dragon Quest. Um, the first couple of minutes, first 30 minutes or so, is a whole, all bunch of talking and stuff like that. As I'm sure you know, this isn't the first time monsters have come to the village hoping to find you. We've all banded together and fought them off. But each time they come back stronger. We can't hold them off forever. Now, you're going to have to learn to protect yourself, Murad. You're going to have to become a monster wrangler. A monster wrangler. Do you know what one of them is? Oh, yes, I do. Well, anyway, I'm talking about the mighty gladiators who marshal their monstrous troops in battle. I just know you'll be a natural lad. After all, it's in your blood. I would love to start. Why don't I get this started with one of my little lot? Thank you. Or well, I can do slime. Ask you a few questions, and I'm sure we'll be able to pair you up with the perfect monster. Oh, we got the Pokemon approach going on. Say you prefer lovable monsters to more rugged types. Um, we're gonna go prefer lovable. Nah, no, I like the rugged monsters. Would you prefer a monster with sleek skin to one that's on the 
furry aside. Yeah, probably a dragon. Do dragon. You make weird and wonderful monsters. Yep. Hmm. Very interesting indeed. Who you got for me? I reckon the perfect match for you is. I'm sure you'll get along. A mud mannequin? Are you happy? Oh well, monster. Can I say no? Then let's start again. Oh, I can say no. I should have the said monster yeah. Monster, I give you will depend on your answers. Okay. I should have said yeah. Would you say you prefer lovable monsters to more rugged types? Let's go. Let's go. No, I like the rugged type. I'm gonna go Do furry. You prefer a monster with sleek skin to one that's on the furry side. No, I'm gonna go furry. Hmm. Very interesting indeed. Oh. I reckon the perfect match for you is this next round. I'm just gonna go. I'm just gonna go ahead and take. I'm sure. Ah, oh, platypus. Famously. Ah. Uh, happy with this monster? Hmm. Yeah, let's just go ahead and take it. You're right. Uh, no. Platypus. It kind of sucks. I should have went with the mud mannequin, but I mean. <laughs> Taking a shine to you. I'm not gonna keep him very long, probably. Learned the ABCs of monster wrangling. Let's head out of the village and get ready to rumble. Most of the time when I'm in these games, I like to um keep on uh breeding so they get stronger and stronger and stronger. Um so I probably won't be keeping plat if I can breed pretty early, I probably won't be keeping platypunk anyway. So but I still should want the mud mannequin though, but it is what it is. Platypunk, he ain't bad, but we'll see how it goes. Now then, let's turn you into a monster wrangler. We'll start with the basics. A monster wrangler's job is to train up their monsters to be good and strong. Yep. Lights, camera. What was that? Hey, did you, did you say something, Alan? Uh, no. That's odd. Could have sworn I heard someone. I did too. Action! I'm here to make you a star. Yeah. Oh Lord. Talent, and I That's a new monster. You a mile off. You're a natural, kiddo. I can see it now. Workshop your skills with me, and you'll have your name up in lights in no time. I never seen that one before. That must that's gotta be a new one. Blimey, Nora. I see you're still as daft as a brush, Fizzy. Monty! It's been a while, but it's never too late. I'm all ears if you ever want to make a comeback. Right. Fizzy here may be a robin. But she's a first-rate instructor of monster wranglers. I reckon I can leave you in her more than capable hands. So a monster helping with monster wrangling. I'm gonna head back to the shop. Drop by once you've finished your training. All right, babe. It's you and me now. Are you ready to shine? <laughs> Lesson one. The basics. Defeating monsters in battle. I hope these monsters are not like out in the wild and stuff like that. Uh, I think they are. Crap. So yeah, I gotta go and attack them one by one. Wild monsters. Just bump into one and get the action started. Kind of sucks, but it is what it is. Your first audition. Big smile now. You're gonna be somebody. I do want to spend a lot of time battling, though. So I might like pick a number 
that I'm going to do per route or whatever, per place, um, to, uh, to battle, like, so I can keep, keep my experience up and keep being able to breed. A slime appears. Holy crap. All these freaking, okay. Tell your party what to do by selecting orders or tactics from the menu. When you're ready, select fight and your monster will carry out the instructions. Select scout and your monster will perform a show of force. If it succeeds, the, the, monster, the enemy monster will join your team. Select flee during battle to run from the fight, but be warned. Sometimes the enemy will read your intentions and cut off the escape. That's dope. Let's, let, let's scout him. Yeah! You stupid. So, we're going to try that again, though. Should should a, should, a, uh, should a show of force fail to concede, the enemy monster may become angered. An anger monster is not one to be taken lightly. The next attack will inflict much more damage than usual. Huh? <laughs> one? Okay. Oh, we can only scout once? That's stupid. Oh, that sucks. Oh, okay. So. Frenzy state. During battle, a monster will occasionally enter the frenzy state that lasts for three rounds. During the duration of frenzy state, not only will the monster's attributes go up, they'll also gain an extra action. That's what's up. So I'm wondering, now that I've done that, though, I gotta get off this. I gotta come out of here. Well, never mind. Done so soon. What did I say, kid? You're a natural. Just keep plugging away, and your monsters will grow up big and strong. Yeah, I'm gonna do a lot of scouting, so yeah, I'll probably end up fighting a lot. Scout a monster, so it joins your team. You stupid! Shut up! I'd have punch you in the All throat. You have to do is hit a critter with a show of force. Get out there and give it a shot. I wonder if the more and more I run into them, the better and better scouts get. Monsters gets. will get right back up after a battle, wanting to join your squad. Just keep at it, superstar. Ah, okay. I got you. I see how this is. Okay, so let me go get that slime again. So... Let's go ahead and scout him again. Let's see what this does. So yeah, the more and more that you fight him, the, the better and better it is to go up. So let's go open this treasure chest. Smoke sirloin. That sounds good. Mm. Okay, so let's go uh, to this bunny corn. Uh, okay, first off, let's try something. Let's attack him first, and then we'll try to scout him. Let's see what that does. There it is. Okay. So, yeah. So, I need to hit first. One of us now. It's just like Pokemon. Hit them first. Um, and, you know, get their health down or whatever. So, I need to find another slime. You scouted a monster already? I tell you, kid. You're going to go far. All right. One more time. With feeling. If you want a monster to join your squad, you can either use a show of force... Oh, you can simply defeat them in battle. If they get back up, when oh. the is won, then they want to team up with you. Okay, so they can do it themselves. Okay. To join you, 
Try tossing them a beastie treat or two. A beast. Ooh. You scout a new monster, but haven't got space in your party. It'll be sent to your monster depot. Bro, I'm gonna have so much fun with this game. Tales. So if you wanna know more, just ask him. Okay. So much fun with this game. Ah, spring. Is there a finer season? Just look at those gorgeous flowers. But you know, the times they are a changing. Now it's summer. Feel that sunlight sizzle. Oh, look over there. Do you see that ivy? In summer, the greenery gets a growth spurt. I wonder if that ivy can take your weight. Try climbing it. All right, hopefully that slime comes back because I want to try to do what I said I did. Further. Walk with me, would you, kid? Okay, let's play the menu. The menu allows you to change your party, adjust gameplay options, and much more. You can also see a record of your adventures so far. Okay, so here we go. Hit that slime again. So I'm going to hit him first. Then I'm going to try to scatter. Okay. No! You piece of crap. I did not mean to do that. I didn't know they was both going to attack. Can I get another slime, please? Wait a minute. From this section, I mean, you can change the order of your monsters or your party, select your attacks for battle, equip accessories, and more. You can also use item skills while assigned to your monster talent points. Furthermore, the handy heal uses the most efficient combination of your monster spells and abilities to restore your entire party's HP so that it's almost full. Okay, so tactics. Uh, what are your tactics? Show no mercy. Uh, provides five options. Controlling how your individual behaving better. Okay. Okay. Well, with that being said, though, that sucks because, uh, let me see. The talent points your monster can earn or can be assigned to their talents. Unlock your skills and traits that will make them more formidable in battle. If you choose to sign all, every point your monster has available will be put in a selected talent. Okay. All right. So, freaking A, I'm mad about that daggum slime. I am upset about that daggum slime. All right. So, orders. Platypunk, Attack, Stump Chump, Bunny Corn. Let's just defend for now. So I can try this. Okay, so let's go. Fight. Okay. So now let's scout. Now. Oh, the more you got in there. Okay, so it don't really have to do with. Oh, he he got scouted anyway with a forty-eight. That's what's up. Okay. Can I get the slime back, please? All I want is that there slime. Okay, there he is. There's one. I'm gonna get him real quick. Yep. All right, so now let's scout. We got three of them now, so. Hey, he should come. Thank you. Okay. You're one of us now. The thing about it, that sucks though because I don't get experience from that. That that's what really sucks. Like if I got experience from that, it'd be great. But 
I don't get any experience from that. And that really drives me crazy. That sucks. So, yeah, I'm going to have to fight. So, But it looks like when you fight the monsters, they go away. So, that's good. I can clear out the area. Now. This was new. 50%. It's 50-50. Hey. I like him, though. <laughs> Vegan Dragora? He's a dragon. What is that? Ooh, a pretty pebble. I don't even know what that is. Fight you real quick. Yeah, I think that slime's gonna come out. So does the vegan Dragora not gain experience? If your monsters acquire talent points after battle, you can assign them straight away from the result screen. Uh, okay, so talent points. Uh, but see who got the talent points though. They don't tell me who got the talent points. Oh, yeah, it does. Okay. All right. So, um, let's just go. Let's go attack booster. Uh, yeah, that'll work. And then one into here. Okay. Okay, that's pretty cool how that works, though. Let's go. I'm upset though that the reserves don't gain experience. Okay, anyway. And that slime is back down there. Oh well. So they do come back after a while. We're gonna fight this slime. Portions of monster munchies. Hey. Another bunny corn. Mm, Platter punk just doing it by itself. Six talent points. Uh, let me see. Hmm. All right. I might wait till I get like ten. So it's down here. Um, nothing worthwhile. Moon warp bulb. Oh, 
Okay. I was wondering why that said I opened that. Nope. find heaps of leaves all over the place at this time of year. Knock yourself out. Go investigate. So it just turns to autumn like that. Group at that big waterfall at the back there. Mm, okay. Piece of manky meat. I say, I hope it lets me scout which one I want to scout. He probably ain't coming. Nope. Somebody has to keep myself down here. Oh, so they do. Okay, so they do gain left. Okay, bro, I was about to be mad, man. <laughs> yeah, let's yeah let's wait till we get ten talent points or twelve or however they want to do it. And that could be a way that I get uh experience too. Ooh, come here, Mister Cluckers. No, dang it. <laughs> That's okay. I need one. Of, I, I would like one of them too. Okay, so scout. Now. Dang it! Everywhere I go. Let's try to go down here. It shouldn't take no longer than one round for us to beat anybody. Okay. What's at the bottom here? Is there anything at the bottom right here? Okay. Well, God dang it. Let's go here. I'm going to have to find some place where I'm not blocking something. What is that? Oh, okay. Let's go fight him again. Maybe we can scout him this time. This whole first video is about to be nothing but like scouting in this little thing. And so I scout everybody's here. Yeah. So yeah, the more and more you fight them, the, the better and better the scout gets. And it failed again. That's okay. More experience. Wolbergine. See, now I'm blocking. God dang it. How about the middle? How about no? Because then I'll be blocking. Good Lord. Hold on. Um, Let's just stay down here. I shouldn't need that message board down there. Where'd that big rooster? There he is. The big rooster. Oh, there's a Drackey, too. Bantamweight? I don't remember him being called Bantamweight, but whatever. Now. Well, this is a new one.
Oh, that hit pretty hard. What was that? Bantamweight. He gave us 10 experience, though. I seen a Drackey. There he is. No, I see. I don't want to go that far yet. There's a Drackey back here. So it was 52 last time, wasn't it? So. Yeah. Yep, every time. There we go. Come on, now. come on, Wolbergine. What is this? Nothing. Okay. Yeah, come on, Drackey. Now. About to say, it shouldn't be hard to scout Drackey. He's always one of the first monsters in the game, so it shouldn't be hard to, to scout him. Oh, yeah. Come on. There's two of them. He's, what, 20 experience? Yeah. Mm, it's going to take a minute for me to get him. I wonder if there's two of them. Can I scout the other one? No. Okay. I was just curious. Slime squisher. So once we start learning magic and stuff like that, I will start um, telling them what to do. But uh, for now, we just we're just fighting. Should be twenty experience right there. Yep. And he got six times point right there. And I got a seed of wisdom. Okay, so a seed of wisdom. Uh, let me see. I think I might wait to put these on until I get like my, uh, to get like my top, um, monster. Don't want you. Hey, Victoria, what's up? Uh, I'm doing pretty good. How about yourself? Now. That's going to be close. He, he might, he might not. I don't know. All right, see? But next time I fight him, it, sh it should be should be on there. Well, I'm glad to hear that you're doing fine also. Thank you for joining the stream. Oh, shoot. I just started. Yeah, this is a new game. Yeah, it just came out today. So. Okay, so he's. Okay, so I, I said we went to get to. Uh, but see, I should go ahead and do those because both of them is already done. So let's go ahead and get. Heartbreaker. And then if you get four uh, for this game, yes. 
Um, let me see. Let's go ahead. I think I'm going to go back and forth. So I'm going to do one, get one, go to the other one. So it's got, don't get him, Heartbreaker. And go back here, do the same thing. All right. Um, I play all kinds of different games. Um, I play RPGs mostly, but I just play sports. Um, I play some shooters. Um, just depends on how I'm feeling on that day. He almost got me. I almost went through and tried to get him. I wish there was a way that like you could defeat him outside of battle, like in Pokemon. Um, Pokemon, uh, wow. Violet and uh, Scarlet, like you can defeat him outside of battle. That'd be, you know, that'd be great if you could do that like right there. Uh, yeah, the Final Fantasy series is actually my favorite, um, my favorite series of games, actually. So, uh, so yeah, so yeah, if you just want to know, know that, the yeah, Final Fantasy, definitely my favorite series of games. Yeah, my favorite Final Fantasy is probably 10, which I'm probably going to do a playthrough on my channel here soon uh, with Final Fantasy 10. So. Which part is your most favorite Final Fantasy? That's what I'm saying. Uh, Final Fantasy 10 is my, uh, is my favorite part. Oh, he can learn heal. I can come in handy. Um, seven is probably my third favorite. So let's go ahead and do what I said I was going to do before. Go back and forth. And then we'll put four. Yeah. Okay. So, and then vegan, do vegan Dragora. Yeah. He's got to be a new one. I ain't never even. See us though. That's going to be nice. Um, I might need to turn these off though. So I need to go to my tactics. Let's see. Don't use magic. Don't use, ma don't use magic. Don't use Don't Don't use ma Don't use Don't use Unless I tell him to. What does that mean? I have no clue what that means. Thank you so much. Um, I'm hoping that I get a, a larger following in the future so I can make this um, so I can make this my job. But just for now, I'm doing it for fun. I got to find. Ooh, hey. Oh, no, it goes to the waterfall, though. I don't want to go to waterfall yet. But there's a rooster down there, though. Now. That might do it. 65. We'll see. There it is. Okay. You're one of us now. So now the only one I have is the...